Okay. Um, one lens everybody's been asking me about, and I don't have it here. Hooray! No, I'll have it in my hands. I've already been reviewing a, a borrowed copy. The Nikon 200mm to 500mm lens I sent that gave back my borrowed copy of the Nikkor 200 to 500 and I did testing against the Tamron 150 uh, to 600. Tamron, no bueno. Uh, no. It was, it was good, but uh, it did not match up to the Nikkor 200 to 500. Usually lenses like that with radical focal lengths are not that good. They're kind of like the 18 to 300. Anything with that kind of broad spanning focal range, you know, nine times out of ten is not that good, especially at both ends. Um, it's kind of like a, a burnt donut, you know, the middle of it might be okay, but the uh, outer edges are just no bueno. Uh, this, however, turned out to be different. I tested it once before and I was impressed and I wanted deeper testing, so I borrowed the Nikkor 200 to 500, and then I borrowed the uh, Tamron 150 to uh, 600, and, uh, I will have it here as far as the video review. I'll go into the full review here in uh, a day or two when I get the lens. So I've actually purchased the lens. I did borrow it and I tested it against the other lens to make sure which one's good. And it's a very good and very impressive lens. So uh, my buddy Greg down in Florida is going, I told you to buy that damn lens because he has that lens. He kept telling me to get it. And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I've got too many lenses already. Uh, but it is good, and uh, I don't have an uh, autofocus lens in that sort of focal range. You know, I've got some big honking prime lenses, but, you know, for 200 to 500 for sports, action, wildlife, the continuous autofocus on is really good. But I'll review the lens. I don't like to review stuff unless I have it in my hands. I mean, I already had it in my hands, borrowed, but I don't like to make video reviews if I don't have it in my hand and I, and I don't own it personally. So I will do that full review when I get it. So I have purchased the Nikon 200mm, the Nikkor technically. The Nikkor 200mm to 500mm f5.6. Great lens, gigantic, extremely heavy, 5.5 pounds roughly. And uh, I will be reviewing that monstrous beast, which of course is not all that uh, inexpensive, but considering what it is at a fixed aperture 5.6, 200mm focal range, it's actually with vibration reduction no less. Uh, that quality fit and finish, it actually is a rather cheap lens. Not cheap, cheap, but I mean cheap in price, as meant. So, Okay, so I'll be reviewing that lens in the next couple days when my actual purchased copy comes in instead of the one I was reviewing, which I had to give back uh, yesterday. So, and anyway, I know I got a good one, and uh, I'll uh, do the review then. Okay, bye.